My wife and I saw an ad on TV several years ago, and uh, it could have been 60 Minutes or, or Sunday morning, and we saw they were highlighting a, a young lady who became a teacher, and uh, a, working, a working adult who became a teacher through Western Governors. So I did some research and found out they're fully accredited. That's a big deal. Uh, I know people who have taken loans out and gotten an education at some place that wasn't accredited, and then they couldn't get a job. And uh, so I wanted to make sure that I was employable. I actually did some research. I called some, I called some school districts and said, hey, if, uh, if I was a graduate of Western Governors, and let me get back to you. Like, oh yeah, they're fully accredited. Yeah, we, we'd hire you. So uh, uh, I, did, I tried to do some of my homework and they helped me with uh, uh, get, get started. I was fixing electronics and I'm kind of a team player and they said, hey, uh, you think you could put the mechanism in this uh, couch, this chair? Yeah, I'll go ahead and try that. So I do it and I end up becoming the furniture technician. It doesn't matter how good of a job I did, a fixed couch is just a fixed couch. When I'm educating somebody, the better job I do, the better off I am, they are, and society is. This motivated me to say, I can do this, I can be this kind of teacher. Uh, I, I go in every day going, I'm gonna do the best job I can. My other job, it was kind of like, well, you know, I did an 80% good job on this couch or this TV or whatever I was fixing, and it, it had, no, had no depth to it, no meaning. This means something. I was working full time while I was going to school, and they knew that. They looked out for that. They helped me, they helped me in those, those situations. I had uh, some really great, uh, really great mentors. Uh, I also had content people. Uh, specifically in physics, so my, my mentor might help me out if I had different problems with what classes are due when, what's the timetable on this, uh, could you step in and try to find somebody's phone number for me. And when I was having trouble studying with something and I just couldn't get a concept, I could shoot an email off to my content uh, person and get an answer back and get help. And uh, sometimes I thought they were tired of hearing of me, but they always answered me. They always came and answered what the kind of help I needed. I could have gotten it done quicker, life got in the way, but they helped out with that, they knew. We worked things out, I took semester breaks. I started it when I was in Seattle, and I moved to where I'm currently located, uh, in the Phoenix area, and it was, it's a phone call and the internet away. Uh, it was great, I could, I, you know, I could do it on, on the road, I could do it at home, wherever I was, I could, I could do some homework. You know, instead of just, this is wrong, do it over, I got a feedback of, hey, you, you might want to correct this or this, check with this. You, they gave you a path and a way to do it. I think it's a really good choice for working, for, for working adults. Don't wait. Uh, the sooner you get it done, the sooner you can start doing something that actually is fulfilling and means something. As I was leaving my last job, one of the other guys looked at me and, and just said, you know, you're so lucky you're getting out of here. And I, but I had somebody else who told me something that was, you're going to go where you want to be. You know, not, and, and, and when I stopped and thought about it, yeah, I, I, I had to drag myself. I had to force myself to go where I didn't want to be, doing something I didn't want to do because I had to have a paycheck. Well, I can now do something I like to do, I want to do, and I'm getting a paycheck. Since I've graduated, I got a job at, uh, at a high school. I've been teaching uh, high school physics for two weeks now. I had two different schools fighting over me. Uh, I'm a highly qualified teacher, and uh, I absolutely love it. The kids are great. Uh, it's really fun because now in the morning I'm going someplace where I want to go. I want to be there and I'm going to do something worthwhile. I'm going to affect people's lives. I've got 140 kids in my, my five classes and, and you know, I, it's just, it just pumps me up. I love seeing them. I hope they love seeing me and, uh, and it's great. There's a look that a teacher knows when a kid gets it and when that happens, I'm, that's, that's fulfilling. When, when somebody gets something that I'm trying to convey to them, a concept that they are not aware of, and I've opened up something in their world that they didn't know about, that's, that's the coolest part.